Hi everybody, Jimmy D for Anyone Can Learn Guitar, and this is our 2-5 lick lesson number 10. This one, I especially like this lick because, as we've discussed with some of the other ones, it's close to the first position of the blues block. So the lick is this. I'm starting on the 4th fret of the 4th string. Fourth fret, fourth string, to the fourth fret on the third, to the seventh fret on the third, to the seventh fret on the second, back to the third string, seventh fret, fourth fret, third string, now the seventh fret on the third string, to the fifth fret, second, fourth fret, first, seventh fret, first string, fourth fret, first string. 5th fret 2nd string, and then we end with the hammer on from the 5th fret of the 3rd string to the 6th fret of the 3rd string. There's our A7. And it's a very overlooked way to get through the key of E as a, as a seventh chord, playing that shape. And it's great because it, it's so close to this, right? It's so close to all of our first position blues block stuff. So you can approach the five that way, but very useful. So here's where it falls. It's a great little lick. I just realized my dog's in the video. Say hi to everybody, Emma. <laughs> making cameo appearance for all you 2-5 lake lovers out there. Make sure and visualize this one quite a bit because it's sort of out of the realm of what we've been doing lately. You can play a B minor, you can arpeggiate a B minor like it. You can arpeggiate an E7 this way. And again, it's great because it's so close to the first position of the blues block. Thanks for watching. Peace.